Today's our annual retail gating uh, experience and wine tasting on second and division, which now we've turned it into what we call Hippie Fest, which has been really, really successful already. We've got a bunch of people downtown dressed in the 70s, and it's like I just grew up again, and I was in back in the 70s when I was in school. So everybody's really getting into it big time, and the retailers here are really, really seeing some really good sales. You know, on top of that, we've got at the arena this evening, we're going to have the UK Blue White Game at the Appalachian Wireless Arena Fan Fest that starts at 3 o'clock and a catwalk at 3.30. So we're real excited about that. Uh, Coach Cal bringing in for that. And all proceeds will be helping, benefiting uh, all the flood victims in the region. This is our third or fourth year for the wine tasting, and it's always been pretty decent turnout. But with calling it the Hippie Fest, for whatever reason, it's brought out a lot of people. But and the weather's been excellent today, so that makes a big, huge difference too. It's it's very nice, you know, mid 70s and sunny, and people are getting out and enjoying the day. Well, they've got numerous booths around town, some food booths. A lot of the restaurants downtown are, are doing 70s themed food. Uh, we've got uh, you can do your own tie dye T-shirt, I think for five dollars. There's another booth that I don't understand it, but you get into a booth type thing and you just sling paint all over it and all over yourself in a, in a bodysuit, and then when it dries, it's what you got. So it's pretty interesting, a lot of fun. People are really enjoying it. Just about every shop that's retail on 2nd Street and Division have specials and bringing their merchandise out on the street to sell at reduced prices, and it's, uh, it's, it's been wonderful, it really has. Watch what you all are doing right now and having all the, the pictures of what's going on down here. And I think people will wish they'd have been here if they didn't have a chance to make it. And there's a lot of people that's been here. So I'm sure there's gonna be a lot of pictures and, and a lot of video out there showing what it was and what you missed out on. Today we're downtown Pikeville for Hippie Fest. We have a lot of local vendors out here. We have wine slushies, wine gummies, we have wine tastings. We have a lot of retail a lot of local businesses, and that's really what it's all about. Everyone to come out and take a peek at what they have. It's not necessary to dress up, but it's a lot of fun to be able to put on some hippie gear and come out and talk to your friends and do a little bit of retail shopping. If you're into the laid back, kind of like the, the hippie vibe, this is honestly the perfect festival for you. We've got the music going on. We have people dressed up. We have all the colors all the good vibes. As always, we just wanna get people downtown. We wanna get people in these stores and really just check out what local businesses we have. We have Peace Love Plants, we have Upcycled, we have baby clothes, we have wine slushies. We have a little bit of everything for anyone to enjoy. I would say my favorite part about Hippie Fest is definitely the wine slushies. They are so good and we actually have wine slushies at a lot of events that we have downtown, so it's actually pretty perfect. As always, you can find out about events like this on Facebook or visit pikeville.com. We are here in Pikeville, Kentucky, downtown at Hippie Fest. They're gearing up on this stage behind me, so you guys are gonna hear some awesome music. We're all having a blast. We've got vendors on the streets. We've got wine tastings. We've got Polly Hollow over here slinging drinks. We're all just having a blast. We've got tons of vendors from out of town, farmers markets, all that good stuff. So at AppCycled, um, the Hippie Fest speaks to our soul. This entire ensemble, you can actually get here any day, anytime. We have a little setup going on outside. We've got stuff going on inside. If you guys know, we're already feeling the hippie vibe. So this event has been an awesome way for us to kind of pull out our duds, our flared pants and our crocheted tops and stuff that we carry year round and really get to showcase that because it goes with the theme perfectly. I think it's speak for everyone when I say we're all having a blast. Who doesn't love a good theme? We've got face painting going on. We've got the hippie bands starting up. So they're playing some 70s style music. We've got some different designs that people have pulled out to go with the theme. It's super fun and we've had a ton of people coming through and it's truly just the more the merrier definitely keep an eye out and join us next year because we have had an absolute blast. It's been wonderful to see everyone dressed up in their best 60s, 70s duds and walking around the streets. 
We've had tons of sales, tons of vendors from everywhere else. This has been one of my favorite downtown events that we've had here in Pikeville because it's just been so different and so fun.